Hello, my name is Leroy Blevins. Welcome to Mysteries and Histories. I just got done uh, reading over some comments and stuff, and people's asking questions and everything else. And, you know, just like on ePatriot, he asked me, you know, would I go back down in Dallas if I could? Yes, I could. I would love to go back down there and spend a little more time. But the last time we went down there, just for the two days, uh, we spent almost like $3,000 just for two days going down there okay and that's a lot of money and that's why my friend Tony he had fun most of it actually almost all of it because you know he wanted me to get down there get this documentary done and everything else which was he was a big help in it and he met us down there and everything else so it's you know it takes that's just for two days and yes there was a lot of things I did want to cover like you know get some other eyewitnesses, I couldn't get a chance to talk to Mary Mormon, you know, and some other things I wanted to do while I was down there. But I was paying attention more into the Dealey Plaza the air, area and then Jack Ruby's walk and everything else like that because I wanted to get all that down because I only had the two days to work with. Okay, and there was a lot of things we had to do, just like uh, when we used a laser pointer, which we used laser pointer on a lot of things. And uh, laser pointers, we went, as you see right here, we angled up, we lined up the bullet holes and stuff, okay, and here's where they lead us back to. As you see here, we it was leading up here, but we brought it down here so we could see it on the wall, because here you see the laser pointer right here. This is where the location, we had to come down on the wall a little bit, we had to bring it down just a little bit when we line up the shots so we can see it because as you see when you point a laser point up here it'd be up in the clouds and the sky won't be able to see it so we had to bring it down just a little bit to see where they end up at when we line them shots up and as you see here they line up right over in this location here this is the one that's this location here and then the other location was right in the same lake uh, same location as well as, as when we line them up Okay, so we did use laser pointers, and we did line up a lot of stuff there when we was there. Okay, it's nothing we cover while we was there, so I just want to show people that. And also, in the same time, I was looking over Amazon, and right now, they have a special run on my book, which you can order Evidence of Conspiracy, because original price is $59.99. But you can order it now for $46.47, and they got it on Prime, $46.47, and that's another savings of $13.52. So anybody wants to order my book now will probably be the best time because you're actually saving yourself more money now because you're saving $13.52 because right now they have it at $46.47. So anybody wants to order Evidence Conspiracy, this will be the best time in the description down below. You'll find a site where you can order my book on Amazon. It'll lead you directly to this site here. Where you can order my book and like i said they got marked down from 59.99 they got marked down to 46.47 so again like i said i always trying to you know i'm glad they did that way because that saves people more money that saves them another 13 dollars and 52 cents they could put in their pocket i don't know how long they're going to run that so you know if whoever has that kind you know type of money they want to order this book and stuff it's best to do as soon as possible because i don't know how long they're going to have that up but I just want to let people know that as well. But like I said, I would go back down there. There is some things I do want to do and cover. Just like ePatriot. You know, if you just send me some stuff, locations and stuff that you wanted me to look over when I was down here, I would have done it. I would have actually went there to them spots and everything else. Because like I said, when I was down there, I had to concentrate a lot more on the murder scene, which is Dealey Plaza, and trying to cover as much as I could in that day, the all day Friday, and then whatever day time we had left on that Saturday before we had to leave. So I had to cover a lot of that because there was a lot of things I also wanted to do, but like I said, we ran out of time, and like I said, it cost money. And like I said, you know, the rooms was like $250 a night, you know, and everything else, you know, when you start compiling everything on there. So, yes, if I had the money, I would go back down there, and I would like to actually spend a week down there, to be honest with you. And I would like to talk to more of the eyewitnesses, 
you know, I would actually like to be able to go inside the buildings and on the rooftops and everything else like that. I would love to have done that as well, but I know they're working on the Rec County Records building now. They got a lot of the inside demolished and stuff like that, and they're working on that. Uh, but like I said, you know, there's a lot of things that I wanted to do that I couldn't do because of the time we had there. But I had to do a lot of concentration on Dilly Plaza right there and get a lot of that done. But like you've seen, I did laser pointers. We've done everything. We've done a lot of testing while we was there. And I just want to make this video here. It's not going to be a long one because I was reading some comments and stuff. People was asking questions and stuff like that. You know, and just like when someone asks a question is, well, how did a Bushka lady get from one location to the next? Because, you know, the motorcade, there's films and stuff. If you ever watch the films and images, you'll see people running across the street in front of the cars, in front of the motorcade. Okay, people run up the hillside there. Uh, when you watch this Pruder film, you see Alt Jen over on one on uh, the other side of Elm Street. But then when he took image number seven, he was running across. Okay, he was running across the street. And then he took that image number seven. And then when we start seeing the other films, he's already on this side of Elm Street where Mr. Spruder and uh, the new ones are. So people is actually running across the roads there as the motorcade was coming through and cops allowed that as well, which I never did understand that. But we see that in the films and images. But like I said, I just want to make this quick video here and stuff like that to give everybody, you know, answer a few questions real quick and stuff and give everybody a heads up that <clears throat> evidence of conspiracy. They have it on that right now on Amazon for forty six forty seven, which you can save yourself thirteen dollars and fifty two cents. So I just want to make this video here and let everybody know that. In the description down below, you find a site where you can order my book, It was Conspiracy, the only book you ever need in JFK Assassination. And also on the site, you're going to see the site where you can make a donation if you want to, a $30 donation or more, and to the GoFundMe account. If I could raise enough money on the GoFundMe account between now and before it runs out, I might like to take another trip down there, you know, if I could you know, within the next couple weeks or so, make another trip down there, and then this trip here, probably interviewing people and working on the outskirts, you know what I'm saying, instead of just in town. So uh, don't forget that like button, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to tell your friends about us. And like I said, on the donation site, it's only gonna be up for a limited time now because we're getting ready to take it down next month. Uh, $30 donation or more, you get your names and a credit, you get a free copy of DVD when it's done. Uh, like I said, you know, uh, as soon as you get this money to get the list, to get the rifles and stuff out and the rest of the ballistic jail stuff, we're going to start doing that as well. So don't forget the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to tell your friends about us. Share this information, other information from my other videos on social medias and stuff. Let everybody know this. Thank you, and you all have a pleasant, pleasant evening.